Hi guys, Larry here. So this is just your friendly March 3rd reminder. There is a ridiculous amount of books coming out March 3rd, which is today. So I just wanted to share the ones that I am really excited about. And there is quite a few. Um, there is probably a lot more that are coming out March 3rd that I am just like not interested in or unaware that they're coming out March 3rd. But there are like three to four books that really did catch my eye. And I was like, ooh, I want that. And I actually pre-ordered books and I like never ever do that. I just don't feel the need to. But this time I did. So I actually wind up pre-ordered three March 3rd books that I'm aware of. I also have a bunch of ARCs that come out March 3rd, but I physically have them. So I'm not going to chat about that in this video. But the first one that I think everyone is super excited about is Crescent City by Sarah J. Moss. book is one that I really know nothing about. I know it's a new fantasy series by her and one that has been getting a lot of high praise and a lot of interest so I'm equally excited for it. Um, I'm not, I really did like her Thorn of Glass series. It wasn't my favorite series in the world but I did read it and I did enjoy it so that's why I wound up pre-ordering it. Um, so yeah we'll see. I really hope I like it. I don't know if I'm gonna get to it in March because it's very very big but I do definitely want to get around to reading it. Coming out March 3rd, which I think everyone is really excited about, is Chain of Gold by Cassandra Clare. A book that I fell really, really far behind on the Shadowhunter train. I'm still reading Lord of Shadows. I know. But I am really excited about it, and I've heard many, many good things from, like, everyone that I've spoke to that have read the series. So I did wind up pre-ordering a signed copy from Good Choice Readings because Cassandra Clare, getting her to sign anything in person is, like, next to impossible. So I did wind up getting that one signed um, to me personally, and I will get around to reading it. I'm actually really trying my hardest to finish my two audiobooks in the month of February so that I can actually read Lord of Shadows and um, Queen of Air and Darkness in March. Might be a little bit of an ambitious goal, but it is a goal that I do have. So that's another high-profile one that I'm really excited about. Printing order was Moment of Truth by Casey West. I love Casey West. I love her, her, her as an author. I love all her series, and I have a girl that I know that was a former student of mine that really loves Casey West. So I purely bought it so I can read it and then give it to her the next time I see her. But this is set in the same world as her Fame Fade and the First Kiss, and um, oh, I forgot the name of the first one, but it was it's it's like in like a companion series and it follows this boy who's like an actor who winds up falling falling into this girl's life and it she's kind of like unex it's like it's it's like an unexpected romance connection which I tend to really really like so those are the March 3rd books that are high profile that were enough to catch my attention that I wound up pre-ordering but let me know what are some March 3rd books that you are equally excited about I'm sure there are a ton these are just the three that caught my attention and I'll talk to you guys later for another video Bye guys. From the present that wants to pop in and say that I did find a few other ones that I didn't know were coming out on March 3rd, but I wanted to share the titles with you. Kingdom of Back, I think it's Back by Mary Lou is coming out, which I am really excited about. Bone Crier Mood is also coming out. Havenfall by Sarah Holland is coming out. Um, and there are quite a few other ones that just caught The Vanishing Deep by Astrid Chalette is coming out. Wicked As You Wish, which is an amazing book. I love that. I read that in 2019. One of my favorite reads of the year, and it, it was so incredible. It's like an inspired fairy tale retelling, which really, really captured my attention that I really wound up enjoying. Um, the Winter Duke is one that is high on my TBR. Night of the Dragon, which is the third shadow of the Fox book, is another one that is high on my TBR. Um... And Witches of Ash and Rune is a book that I got at New York City at um, ALA. Um, and a lot of other books. Every Reasons We Shouldn't. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of books that are coming out. Those are just the ones that caught my attention that I wanted to share with you guys. But there is a lot coming out March 3rd. So I hope that this video has inspired you to maybe do some pre-ordering, which is something I don't often do. But I, I did do it this year, and I'll talk to you guys later for another video. Bye, guys.